It's the Streamlab stop working. Way down there on Gudera Street. It doesn't work in that area. It's okay, we just went through Montecito tennis courts and golf courses. We just walked through them. They flipped me off a bunch of times. All right, my nephew. I found one for you on State Street of Santa Barbara. I am now limping up State Street. Oh my God, I am in so much pain. Oh, putain de vache, que j'ai mal. Now I am in so much pain, I don't know why. My heart's fine, surprisingly. But my little old legs, my little old grandpa legs, they, uh, oh, they're not making it. And we got another 10 miles up this wonderful, beautiful street to even make it to the top there by the mountain where Golita starts. Nolita isn't even there yet, and that's where I live. All right, this is the adult, it's the adult store filmed on the hard drive because the memory and the battery is messed up with Streamlabs and it doesn't even know how to work in some of these places, no matter what you do to it. Now we're walking up to that pizzeria where that bouncer gave me a hard time. And that pissed me off. I didn't forget it. I remember him from hurting our fans and friends when I was in a punk band. It's one of those asshole bouncers. And everyone said, oh, just let it go. Well, right now, I'm without my meds. I'm without pot. I'm limping. I'm so freaking pissed off. I'm going to walk by. If he allows me to walk by, we're just going to go get some water. But if he says anything to me, I will stop. I will show that I am walking on public property and I will stand there and blab and film him till he can't take it, till he needs to call the cops and then the cops will school him on photographing in public. You, there's a bunch of you who needs to be schooled that. We can do that. It's called the First Amendment audit. If you don't know what your First Amendment rights are, I'm gonna teach you with the Second Amendment right. And then I will plead the Fifth and throw in the Four in there, right? And play Louie Louie to you. This is Music Alley, live music. That's where I would play Louie Louie. Look how closed it is. Do you think my favorite pizzeria that got ruined by some weird bouncer is also closed? Because that would mean that they're out of business. Which means, ha ha, stupid bouncer from LA, go back home we got nothing left for you that would be a happy ending because i don't know it's like right by the knee i got the knobbly knee now i made fun of that guy so he was over there i can tell he's not there anymore so this isn't going to be as fun but my place giuseppe's oh shit it's further down it's over here where there's a place called Andoshin. I don't think it's a place anymore. No. When, but when I was talking to him, it was still a place. And it was called Giuseppe's. It was a music bar. This guy told me it wasn't there. In the 80s. I was there. I was a bouncer. I'm one of those bouncers who doesn't need to yap and do that crap. Stupid crap that just starts drama and fights. There's ways 
of being a skinny bouncer, dude. But you don't know, you're too hefty. Now they didn't want me filming this. Haha. Uh -huh. I can film this, and they didn't want me filming inside. Well, I am now, dude. I am. King of pizza. I am now filming your place. Hi. That's right. That's the place that said I couldn't film. That's what it looks like inside. That's what it looks like. Now he thinks I'm filming him. Yeah, that's what it looks like when I'm not filming you, stupid prick. And tell me I can't do it. Send out the bouncer, tell me. <laughs> I can't point to this. That guy, it's not the bouncer. But he's the one who's gonna send him out here to tell me something. And he's got nobody this time to protect him. They got nobody. You got nothing here, people. You got nothing. Ha ha. That's actually happy. I'm not even limping. I wasn't happy because I thought I was gonna have to do that thing where I was gonna be like, yeah, chase me, bro. He wouldn't have made it, right? He's always standing there. I always said, race me to that thing. He wouldn't have made it, right? He would have been like, uh, uh. All right, I need some water. I'm gonna go into this liquor store, not mess with them, and just get some water, because yeah, definitely, it's, it's, ah, see my jaw. It hurts so much. Yeah, I just thought I would see him, because this is the perfect time when I'm not on my meds, and I'm not partaking in some marijuana. It's as though I'm not sober anymore. It's as though I'm completely drunk and I just want to kick some ass. Anyways, let's end this at 7.30. 7.09, 7.10, 7.11.